For structural modeling in Revit, guys, there are some items that you can work with. For example, first we need to add the levels based on the number and the height or the elevation codes that we have in mind. For example, something like this. And then we can, for example, enter the first level and start adding the required axis. And we can do that quite easily based on what we have in mind or even according to a specific reference. Then in the next step, we can start adding the modeling elements such as the columns. First, we need to select the type that we want from the type selector. Then, for example, we can set this on height up to the second level. Then up here, we can use add grids, select all of these except for these ones. Finish. Remove. Then we need to enter the second level. Now up here, select beams. Then select a type. And then up here, we can use on grids. I can select all of these. Finish. Now we need a slab. And basically start sketching your slab or adding it to the model. And also add trim to trim out the extra parts. finish then from 3d we need to enter one of these views maybe maybe north yeah it'll do select all of these get a copy and paste them into the next levels and well as you can see guys just like this we would be able to create a model for our structure for our main structure in our projects